You know, I think I need a mimosa for this. Just kidding, it's a Bellini. Level up, bitches. So today we're gonna talk about weddings because it is wedding planning season. And though it should be one of the happiest processes of your life, it's gonna fucking suck because you're gonna spend way more money than you should. The wedding industry is akin to Satan himself. It's pretty much all about profiting off of girls' childhood dreams of becoming a princess and falling in love and marrying a prince, which is like cool, but it's not the most important thing in life. Regardless, I think the average wedding is about 10 or 20 thousand dollars which is fucking insane millennials are already in debt from college it is in, it's completely insane to for that to be the average amount that you have to pay for a good time to celebrate what should be the most happiest day of your life and there's all this pressure from your family and your friends and your parents to make it perfect and exquisite and super expensive and impressive Fuck that shit. All a wedding is is a party, and it does not take that much to throw a party. Speaking as a former bride, I had a very cheap wedding, and it was beautiful. It was about four or five thousand dollars, and you know what? I still could have done better. So let me lay some fucking knowledge on y'all brides to be, because I wish I had done some of these things. Number one, the wedding is about you. You are the center of attention, you and the person that you're marrying. So have whatever kind of wedding you want to have. If you want to do it in a church, fine, do it. If you want to go in the woods somewhere and wear a camouflage wedding dress, fucking do it. If you want a taco truck at your wedding, do it. If you want to go to Hawaii and have a destination wedding or Siberia for all I care, do it. Because first of all, I learned that from a guest list at a wedding, you will learn who is truly there for you. They will show up if they care that much about you and or if they have the money, because some of us are broke sometimes. <laughs> if they are truly there for you for you and your beloved, ooh, the Bellini is getting to me. If they are truly there for you and your beloved, they're not gonna be judging where you decide to have your wedding. They'll probably be like, oh my God, that is so them, because it will be you, because it will be whatever you chose. You only get one of these, so do whatever the fuck you want. Secondly, when you're doing vendors, uh, try to keep it as much of a secret as possible that it is a wedding. As soon as they find out that it's a wedding, they add wedding fees for, I don't know what reason, because it's evil. Shit, you can even make your own bouquets by yourself. Get them, them bridesmaids together, you're gonna have a little factory right in the middle of your living room the day before. It is not that hard. My wedding dress was not actually a wedding dress. It was a quinceanera dress. And everybody's like, oh my god, that dress looks beautiful. Where did you get it? How much did it cost you? I'm over here like, oh, it's a secret. <laughs> But really it cost like $200 at some ratchet mall in Houston, <laughs> whatever. I think that if I were to do it over again, I would have a courthouse wedding, I'd have my bridesmaids there, I'd have them all wear black dresses instead of me having to go to David's Bridal and pick a dress and hope that it fits them right or whatnot. We'd get married right there and you know what, then we'd uh, just go pub crawling all day. Maybe have dinner at a nice restaurant that's maybe not Olive Garden for all the family that may have flown out, but uh, that would have been it. Bottom line here, make sure you have fun at your wedding. You can be a princess and save your pocketbook. It is possible. <laughs> that's my two cents. It's March right now. Y'all bitches have time to cancel your super expensive shit before June, which I know that's when all of y'all are getting married because my bitch has got married in June. It's the basic bitch month to get married. We all did it. It's fine. It's fine. Spend all that money on the honeymoon, okay? Just saying.